I'm Johnny, and it's time for Temporary Autonomous Zones. This is a concept that was first articulated by an individual named Hakim Bey. His writing is rather interesting, if not a touch opaque. He's a pretty heavy duty anarchist thinker. He's got some very interesting ideas. He's also got some ideas that are a little troubling, but like most good thinkers, definitely worth checking out. Now, when he writes about the temporary autonomous zone, hereafter called the Taz, he explicitly says that he encircles the concept, but never quite points directly at it. I bring this up because I just finished the greatest international scavenger hunt the world has ever seen, as I mentioned in the other video. And while I participated in this scavenger hunt, as it went on, I started to feel slightly different. I started to get a, a sense of community with the people that I participated with. I started to get a feeling of togetherness. It's a very rare feeling that you can sometimes encounter at places like Burning Man or at raves in the 1990s. But there is something to it and there is something special about it. And so I found it interesting that Gish Wes had the ability to create this feeling of the Taz. There's some potential here that's worth exploring. So Gish Wes was started by Misha Collins, who is one of the actors in this show, Supernatural. And there are a lot of Supernatural related items on the scavenger hunt, but there's also a lot of Kale related items. Kale is somehow the, um, the special vegetable. Is it even a vegetable, leafy green, whatever? So there is like this whole system around Supernatural. Like it's turning into a little crazy piece of Supernatural fanfic culture thing. So in some ways, this kind of goes against a lot of what Hakim Bay believes and goes against the idea of the temporary autonomous zone because there is this whole capitalist corporate supernatural tv show broadcasty thing going on but on the other hand the actual items in the scavenger hunt a lot of the items in the scavenger hunt are geared towards well a couple of things one creating chaos and insanity in the world to really expanding your boundaries and trying out things you would never do in a zillion years and three creating community around you and with the people around you to shake up people's world like this one week in the year and sort of kick this ball a rolling. It seems to me to be quite special. The videos and photos that I'm going to show you are going to be exactly that. They're going to show you ways in which Gish West has the spark, the potential to help create community, the potential to get you to try new things and remember kids scavenger hunts are fun miss montgomery we need to synergize with the youth of today should have been a lion tamer like my parents wanted me to i need to get down now <laughs> <laughs> Together. You are really gonna get it. 
tonight, big boy. 